You know, if you like a good laugh, and who doesn't these days, you'll want to get to the Long Wharf Theater in New Haven, where Steve Solomon's My Mother's Italian, My Father's Jewish, and I'm Still in Therapy. Runs through July 18th. After playing the sold-out houses in oh, all over the place, but two of them here in New Haven, Steve Solomon continues his comedy chaos with this critically acclaimed prequel to his original smash hit, Still in Therapy. Steve. It's all about growing up in a wild house and a wild childhood. Thank you so much for being here. Thanks for having me, Steve. It was really, um, it's exciting to be back in New Haven. My gosh, and you go all over the place with this thing, right? Yeah, um, this year alone we did 60 cities. 60 so it's, cities. It's amazing. Yeah, and they seem to love you here in New Haven. I, I love New Haven, yeah, and the reason is real simple. They get it. I mean, I've done the show. Most of the time, they get it. I did the show like in Nebraska. They didn't get it in Nebraska, but that was okay. They get it. Well, here, that's Nebraska. Now, you also you wrote it. Yeah. You star in it, yeah. and it's a one-man show. Yeah. All right, tell us a little bit how all this came well, together. I got, there are about 20 characters in this show. 20 and characters I, that you're doing. I do all the voices, and, and it's an interaction between my mom, my dad. The, this, this show takes place at my dad's, for my dad's 85th birthday party at his clubhouse in the senior community that he lives in, and that's the set. And we're waiting for them to get there. And they hear about my family, and then the doctors, and the lawyers, and the people that they meet on the street. And then my, my family never shows up, so I start talking to the audience about different things in my life. And they get the interplay they love, because my mother would yell at my father, Hey, guy, you don't believe in miracles no more. No more miracles. Says, I believe in miracles. Why don't you leave me alone? You don't think Jesus walked on water. I believe that Jesus walked on water. I just think it was in the winter. <laughs> <laughs> so that, that's what goes on through the whole show, with the arguing and the... The people that they meet, there's a whole bit about me traveling, and the audience relates, and that's what makes it work. They, they know somebody in the show. But, but it's almost like stand-up, but there's a storyline to it, right? There's a story threads right through it, right from the beginning to the end, and it's it. The phone calls come in. My sister, the smoker, is a three-pack-a-day smoker. Oh, God. Talk, she talks like that, but had nothing to do with, with a cigar, cigarette. <laughs> I said, she's real excited. She just signed up for an internet dating service for heavy smokers called gotamatch.com. <laughs> and she's a character who calls, and it's, it's a lot of fun. It's a great right, but, but some of the stuff you, you touch on is a little bit you know, delicate, like mixed marriages and some of that. How do you, how do you deal with all that? Um, I, I, we all went through it. And it's, um, it, it's difficult because there's arguing, there's debates. I mean, there's one scene where I said my father got to the point where he was looking at his burial plot as a vacation getaway. <laughs> And there, there's a couple of scenes which are touching, and the rest of it is just pure laughs, and it works really well. And 20 different characters. Yeah. You cover all this. Now, what are, what are, what are some of the other characters you got out there? It was my daughter, yeah. you know, who's... She talks like this, and she's always mad at me, and she says, was I adopted? I say, no, not yet. The ad just came out. <laughs> and, and the interactions with her and, and, and the doctors that we meet and... the. Like I said before, when the people walk out of the theater, they're all saying, my God, that was my family, or that's my doctor, or that's my friend, or this is the... And they identify, and that's why it works. Are there animals? You got dogs and cats in there? There's stories about dogs and cats, but <laughs> a couple of them are a little uh, edgy, so I, wanted, I don't want to do them on your show, but that's okay. It's okay. Yeah, we got to be careful about that edgy yeah, stuff. We'll right. talk about that afterwards. Yeah. Now, the show is running now through... The 18th. Through the 18th. July 18th. Okay, and yeah. there's still, still tickets available. All the information is, is up there on the screen. This is, this is all going on right now at the Long Wharf Theater. It's a fantastic place. All right, be, uh, before I let you out of here, just give me a, a little bit more of a conversation between your mom and dad there. Well, I guess I, the, the ones that I love are the, are the arguments that they have about the religion and, and the fights that they have about this. and that. I, I, I don't want to give too much away, yep. but that's, that's half of it, is my mom's got this attitude, my dad's got this attitude, and he's a very simple man. You just leave me alone. I don't want to hear anything. And, and she's always edgy and... Then there's interactions with the three of them, and it, 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 believe me, it's a lot of fun. So you don't have to be Jewish to get the show? No. You don't have to be Italian to get the show? No, it were, we did it in Spokane three times. It wasn't a Jew or an Italian for 600 miles, <laughs> and they sell out every year, so it's a lot of fun. And what was it that drove you to actually start putting this down on paper? Um, I, I needed to tell people about my life. Mm -hmm. They had to know what goes on. And part of it was the fact that it's fun. And, and, and I, I look at things in, in a different twist. It was like, um, I, I, I don't want to, um, a couple of months ago there was this thing on TV, I, I don't want to spend too much time on it, but I, I'm looking at this ad that where uh, an airline wanted to start charging for people to use the bathrooms. I don't know if you saw that on CNN. And I'm saying to myself, this is what I think, I said, how do they figure pricing? <laughs> I want to see this menu. 
you know, and I start doing a whole bit about that, and that's that's why it works. I love it. And, and the name of the show again? My mother's Italian, my father's Jewish, and I'm still in therapy. It's the long walk right now through the 18th. Thank, thank you. you so much. Thank I you, will Steve. be there. All right, good. All right. Hey, I want to thank all of our guests today. Constellation Health Services, Quasi Amusement Park, Long Wharf Theater. Steve, you're awesome. But most of all, thank you for watching. Make it a great day. See you later.